Yo boys, it's Dan. Welcome to the Europa League playoff round for the first legs. Yes, welcome to guys the Europa League playoffs, which means that this is the second places from each of the Europa League groups and the Champions League not well third places. And we're gonna start off with Feyenoord versus AS Roma. Now AS Roma came second in their group, which was which was the Sheriff Tavis Bold group with Slavia, with Sparta Prague in it. And, oh, sorry, one, one of the Prague's in it. And they play Feyenoord, Feyenoord team who were third in the Atletico Madrid Lazio group with lots of Celtic in it. I mean, if, to be fair, this is too late to fail like it was last time. So, I mean, anything could happen. Anything could happen. Anything can happen. I'm going to say it. We've Final two AS Roma two all change up yeah yeah so that will be a two draw in that game and then we go to Galatasaray versus Sparta Prague now Sparta Prague were in the Rangers Betis that sort of group now if if you didn't know what happened to this, and Galatasaray was in the Man United Bayern group and Kohei Egan group if you don't know what happened then if you don't know what happened. Um, that spot that spot that Slavia that spot of Pike were third in their group into the last game needed needed a win. They won their game because Rangers beat um Batiste to finish top of the group. That group got crazy. That that group got absolutely crazy. And I am and in this game you'd you you'd expect. Galatasaray to win at home. They are a very good team at home. Oh, uh, they're, they're a very good team at home. Oh, Galatasaray, they're a bit unlikely at home. They came from behind, so I'm going to go 2-0 to Galatasaray in this game. And there we go to Shakhtar Donetsk versus Marseille. Now, Shakhtar Donetsk, they were in, I will just, they were in the... Barcelona and FC Porto group, and Marseille was. Marseille came second to Brighton and Hope Albion in their group because Brighton beat them at the at the Amex to top to to top the group. What on earth? Top the group? Wow, we. And I'm gonna say that Marseille, yes, are a good team. So so are Shakhtar. But I mean, you accept Marseille the quality they've got, with the quality they've got, the players that they've got. You have to, have to, have to say Marseille. I'm gonna go Marseille two, Shakhtar Donetsk one. Now we go to FC Young Boys Sport versus Sporting Club de Portugal. Now Young Boys was in the South the Manchester City group, Leipzig group. And Sporting Club and Sporting Club de Portugal, they were in the Atalanta group with with Glass and and Wakuv and Wakuv Tespahova. So yeah, I mean you would you'd only say there be you don't you you could only say that sit there be in one minute here, and that is and that is Sporting Club and that is Sporting Club de Portugal. Sporting Club, Sporting Club de Portugal. You have to send them back. You have to, yeah, you have to back sport in this game. So I'm gonna go sporting. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go young boys two. No, yeah, young boys two. It'll be an interesting game. Sporting club the Portugal for we. It'll be an interesting, interesting game. I think. And to Benfica versus Toulouse now. Benfica, they were 
in the they were in the Inter Salzburger group and flight and um, Toulouse they was in the Liverpool group with with Union Saint Gallois and Lask and I am I mean Benfica not Portuguese champions two Portuguese teams in this now and I'm gonna say that you would expect it to be Benfica but Toulouse as we know I know pushover we we've seen this before. We've seen these teams come from the champ, come second places and beating the team in third, like Man United did a few, like Man United did last year, I think, by beating um, Barcelona, who came down from the who who came down from Champions League and were out in the first and then lost to them. So yeah, and, but we don't know about. I mean, Benfica should have far, far, far too much. So I'm gonna go Benfica two, Toulouse nil, and now we move to. Milan versus Stad Lenez. Now Milan was part of that men of that bar of that PSG, Dortmund and Newcastle group. This could have been Newcastle, but it's not, it's Milan. To be fair, if you're a Milan if you're if you're part of Milan, you'd you would you you would say that this is your best bet to win a run home for this year, but I don't know how we're doing I don't know how we're doing in that in in Celia A in Serie A this year. And Stad Lens, they were part of the Stad Lens. They were second to Villarreal in the in their group with Kabi Haifa and Panathinaikos. Yes, and I'm gonna say that it would be eight. That would be it would be Milan three, Stad Lens one, and now we move to RC Lens. This is SC Freiburg. Now, Lens were part of the were part of the Arsenal PSV group with also the Sevilla. So no Sevilla in any competition. The eight-time La League, the eight-time and um, U Europa League winners are no longer in the Europa League. They have been they have been done by RC Lens and Flyburg came second in their group to West Ham United. My word, my word, my word. Now, Lens, Lens did Lens did beat um, Real. No, sorry, Lens did beat um, Arsenal on the first game week, if I remember correctly. Well, a game week anyway. And now, now they're playing Freiburg in the playoff round for the Europa League. And I'm gonna say that Freiburg are no pushovers. They came second to West Ham in that group. So I'm gonna go. I'm missing my, my first draw of a two-all draw between RC Lenz and SC Freiburg. Now we go to the last game of the first legs, which is Sporting Cluj de Brada versus FK Carabag. Now Carabag came second behind Leverkusen. I mean, to be fair, Leverkusen won that. I mean, I'm gonna I'm not gonna talk about Leverkusen, but just say that Leverkusen are fine. Braga was part of Braga was part of the Champions League. They are part of a Napoli group. They're part of a Real Madrid Napoli group with um Union Berlin. Union Berlin. And Carabag like I said, but I mean Carabag had been getting to be fair, Carabag had to be fair, half their teams were getting absolutely smashed by by, by Lenin, to be fair. That was with that that was with Hacken and Mulder. <laughs> And Leverkusen, obviously. So I'm going to go Sporting Cluj de Blagach to um, FC FK, FK Carabag nil, and that will bring this Europa League playoff round leg number one to an end. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you lot in a couple of hours' time for a Valentine's Day video with my girlfriend. If you're not interested, if you or the next predict video is the Premier League one on Friday. So I'll see you in a few hours or I'll see you lot on Friday for Premier League game week number 25 of the Premier League. And till then, boys, peace.